Hey y'all, welcome back to Bloodstained, Ritual of the Night. Um, I beat the boss who was uncomfortably hot, don't ask questions, uh, about my interests, and I, I'm, I'm just gonna go, yeah, uh, let's, uh, let's go, yeah, uh, Ar Arventaville. Hey, I can one-shot those guys now, nice. Bruh. That rat got fucked. You know, I can't, like, see if I can get anything from that black guy. Like, the goo man. Oh. That child's dead. Or is she a child? I can't tell. What the fuck's up with her? Why'd she have to do, like, the fucking little pose? Like, oh yeah, I did it. <laughs> oh, thank you, Miriam. You know who I am. And that means... I'm guessing you're my contact. I'm sorry we couldn't get here sooner, Dominique. So Dominique. this is our contact. Yes, the church She looks like me. she's a nun As who moonlights see, as like a BDSM... About expelling uh, demons. ...dominatrix. An exorcist. And we're lucky to have you, Dominique. And the church you, Miriam. Thank You wouldn't have asked if it wasn't important. But you should not... She deserved... Yes, I told you when I contacted you that the Shardbinder Jebel is responsible for summoning the castle. Yes, there's no mistake about... What? Then let me get right to the point. I find it curious that the outpouring of demons facilitated just happens to coincide with the sudden awakening of the other... You're right. It is strange. But the church... Oh, do you dis- I asked you to bring her here so she could see the horror. I have no intention of forcing you, Miriam. I'm pretty sure she's here to help no matter what. You don't have to. She wouldn't be here at all I if she didn't want to help. Word that I would stop him. What happened here only strengthens my resolve. Thank you, Miriam. I am sorry to put it on your shoulders. Um, pardon me? Oh, hello there. Are you alright? We didn't mean to ignore you. Speak for yourself, I did. I'm alright, thank you. You are quite welcome. Do you have a name? <laughs> what if she was just like, no? Anne. Damn it! <laughs> what a lovely name! Anne, you shouldn't be out here. Let me take you somewhere safe. Oh, alright. Come on, this way. Oh god, I really do just wish that she just be like, nope! <laughs> <laughs> that would have been funny. What's this? Alright. I'm just gonna go slap that thing until I find out if... Until either I get bored or I find out if it can give me a superpower. Actually, I might as well also kill Big Rat and this guy. See if I can get some of them. Oh, hey, Big Rat did have a power. Bone Morte. Oh, summon Rat. What? I can summon a Rat? That's sick. I like that. I like that a lot. So this just leads me to think that there's probably an ability from each enemy in the game, which is cool. I'm guessing this guy will let me, like, throw one of those bone things that he's- stone mask. Is that a motherfucking JoJo reference? Okay, maybe not. What, what is that? what do those little things down there mean? Not everything is a JoJo reference, unfortunately. As sad as it may be to say. Rat! 
rat tail and stone mask. <laughs> I like that. I like the fact that I'm now in cheese. Oh my god, that's silly. I like it. I don't understand why the giant rat would actually drop cheese. Oh? Purple sword? Bones. I knew it! I motherfucking knew it. I knew it was gonna be a bone toss. I even said. I was like, that's, that's, that seems like it's, the power's gonna be throw a bone. And it was. I might be psychic. I like the whip a lot. Okay, so it appears like the attack cooldown is shorter mid-air, but the range is slightly less. I still want to see if that guy gives me something more. Actually, wait, let me see how rat does. <laughs> rat. Alright, so what is the... Okay, so rank increases the duration. So if the boss abilities can have grades as well, there must be a way to, like, refight bosses. Bone. Cool. Wait, what the fuck was that? It was a tiny rat. Alright, let me see if a different weapon might work better against it. Claymon? a lot slower, so... Claymore is probably not the rat-killing weapon. Uh, short sword, maybe? I'm done with that now. <laughs> I have amused myself long enough. Yeah, right, let's see. So, nothing manipulative. Wow, this is really cool. I'm going back to head flail, though. It's just way cooler. Oh, this is a safe area. I did some looking around before. And this place seems secure. Thank you. Yes, agreed. Johannes, you, Anne, and I will remain here. We can assist Miriam from safe ground. What? We can't ask her to brave the castle alone? Don't be foolish. She is trained in combat. Are you? We would only get in the way. I mean, it sounds cowardly, but she's totally right. But that's not the point. I'll be fine, Johannes. Please don't worry. All right, but we'll be here if you need us. Let's not waste any time. We have a lot to do. Come back if you need anything. I'll get a workshop running so I can perform alchemy for you. Thank you, Johannes. I know... <laughs> Thank you. 
Alright, so I'm guessing Little Girl will probably sell me something. And the Exorcist will probably give me some kind of... Ow. What the fuck's this? Miriam, welcome. Since this is your first time here, let me tell you a little bit about the supply post. I have made arrangements so you can buy... I would have liked to provide what you need for free, but seeing as we are largely cut off from the church's funds out here, I will need money in order to keep the supply post stocked. I hope you don't mind paying. Okay, that's... At, usually when games are like, oh, the hero has to buy a thing, even though they're saving the world, it's like, really? That's actually a good point. This, like, that's a good reason to have it, like, still be expensive. No, I understand. I appreciate you doing what you can. I can also buy shards from you, if you no longer need them. Wait, is trade in demon shards even allowed? Of course. The church would sooner gather them up, and make certain they are purified. I am not permitted to sell them, but I can buy them off you. You may want to keep extras, since possessing multiple shards of the same type, and more importantly, may accelerate. I still recommend- Alright, I think that explains- Oh hey, maybe what those extra dual hand. What are you looking to sell? Oh man, I only have the nine. But damn, wow, that is a really good way of making money. What are you looking to buy? Okay, damn, some of these things are fairly expensive. Alkahest. Hmm. Okay, so... Oh, eyeglasses. Defense, intelligence, constitution, and mind. Hmm. I already own both the scarf and the tattered scarf. Oh, ring. Okay, so I have one of these that gives me three defense, one intelligence, two mind. Four defense, two intelligence. Is this right? Then we have a deal. Yeah, I do want that actually. What are you looking to sell? Is this right? Then we have a deal. Is this right? Thank you. Is this right? Thank you. Is this Myself right? Then we have those. a deal. Is this right? Many thanks. There we are. What are you looking oh, to buy? Oh, so you can get rounds that let you penetrate. Enemies, that's cool. What are you looking to buy? Oh, and the stock just shows how many I own. Okay, that makes sense. There are knives concealed inside the boots. That seems... Uh, like it should maybe be illegal. Okay, no, I, I can't spend all my money oh, right now. I forgot to give this to you. It's the key to the building. You can use it to explore further in. Thank you. I invited the other survivors inside where it's safe. They all have troubles that need resolving. If you can spare them the time, I'll do what I can. I know yeah. you will. Come back anytime. I'll be praying for you. Oh? <sighs> Dominique, what... That is photograph. Photo. To put it more plainly, it allow. What? Unfortunately, I'll see if I can. Oh my god, it's just like dress up, isn't it? Oh, hello, Miss. Oh, you're looking fit as ever. I don't like her. <laughs> I don't know why. There's no reason for me to dislike her, but I just. I, I don't. Ah, yeah. uh, here she is. You have to marvel at the church's resources. Look at what they've provided for us. I know, it's in- So, what I can do for you here in the workshop is take materials you bring me and transmute them into new items. But the alchemy is easier to show you than- All right, cool. What are we transmuting this time? Oh, so this way I can get weapons without having to spend money. Pirate hat, I like that. Three defense. Uh, is there a way to like? Oh, okay, yeah, that shows. So I'll lose con one constitution, but I'll gain luck. Neat. Hmm. 
bat wings. Oh. So I lose one mine, but gain two ints. I don't know what those stats do, though. Oh, foods. Oh? Interesting. So you, it looks like you get like a permanent buff the first time you make each food. Nice. Oh, and then enhance the shard. Head flail. I'll go with this. I'll go with this. I'll go with this. So, head flat on steel. Thrashing tentacle. I'll go with this. Cool as fuck. I'll so, I want to upgrade this. that. This. I'll go with this. I'll go with this. Once I've transmuted an item, I'll pass. I'll do my best to inform you of what items you can make, but when it comes to items I don't know about, you'll have to find a formula for me and bring it here. That I makes understand. Sense. Also, the demon crystal you've obtained, the shards. Those can be transmuted. This each shard requires specific materials, but it try it when you get. I think I. Also, neither one of us has been eating. If you bring me the ingredient with proper nutrition and a very. Hmm. So how? Ah! Holy shit! <laughs> that got like stupidly big. All right, here's the save spot. All right, uh, I think that's all for this time. Uh, yeah, slowly making progress. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, consider liking, subscribing, and all that. And I'll see you again next time. Bye bye.